Hello. Hello. Hi, Havara. Good to see you. Can you see me? Hello. Yes, I can. Yeah. Okay. How's your Christmas? Well, uh, I'm not celebrate Christmas. In I here. don't celebrate yes. Christmas. Yes, I am a Muslim, so oh, friend only celebrate it. Mm, yes, of course, I respect that. But of course, as you know, it's common to ask, "How's your Christmas?" What did you do? How did you celebrate it? Because I am so curious and interested to whatever you have done to your life those times. And while me, while I also celebrated with my family, yes, uh, with, you know, some festive food and uh, we've, got, we've got a parlor games as well. And Haura. Yeah. Yes. So you are a Muslim. What are mm -hmm. those Muslims do during Christmas? Don't you prepare any kinds of food? Just as in nothing? Oh. Or normal days well, like that? I think I make some mac and cheese. You make a mac and cheese. Mac and ah, cheese. you have made a cheesecake. I make. Um, it's like macaroni and cheese. Ah, macaroni and cheese. Is yeah. it? Yeah. Uh, how you call potato salad? <laughs> macaroni. <laughs> yeah. yeah, it's a macaroni. Okay. Macaroni yeah. with cheese. Yes. Oh. <laughs> okay <laughs> it's very funny yeah, i'm making fun of the food sorry i'm just dream dreaming of a uh, macaroni with vegetable potatoes and <laughs> oh. some kind of salad my uh potato salad and the like you know okay yeah. so you have prepared macaroni cheese mm -hmm. That's very delicious. And? Yes. Oh, just that. Wow. Um, really it's lazy very though. delicious. <laughs> what? I am a lazy person, so <laughs> I don't <laughs> that many. Yeah, you also like me sometimes to uh, not doing a lot of cooking practice. Yeah. yeah look at my hand, I just my hand. yeah i have a very long nails it means i don't do a lot of <laughs> <laughs> these <Yeah>. toughies <laughs> well how uh -huh. yeah. yeah other yeah participants i would like to accept yeah mm -hmm. okay yeah. what kind of lesson do you want how um what kind of lesson do i want yes that's right because today's topic i would like to give you how you could sound more american yeah, yeah. but i'm waiting to other participants to join in our lesson so we could start mm -hmm. also thank you Haura, for a conversation it was fun okay yeah hi habib can you see me? Yeah. It will be better if you're going to get engaged in the lesson because this is your opportunity to speak out to whatever expressions or the things that you have done last Christmas. And it would be a greater experience for you to speak out into a group. Yes, I encourage you to speak out even though we have some mistakes into our grammar, it doesn't really matter because the first steps we have to do is to, you know, to lessen your stress 
your nerves becomes much more even comfortable. And then, so you could think even well, you could think well, and you can say better, you can pronounce even better. And uh, yeah, it doesn't give you a lot of pressure to speak up. How could I call you Habib? Is it your real name, Habib? You can unmute it so that you can speak and we can hear you also. Yeah? No, nothing? Okay. So how about Muhammad? Hi. Good to see you. Can you say hi also? Ah, yeah. Alpha. I remember your name. Thank you for changing it. <laughs> Hello, Ms. Kipi. Hi, good to see you. And uh, could you tell me what did you do last Christmas, even though you are not celebrating it? What I do in Christmas is yes, I take to go fast. You in the weekend, I take the two vote test. Ah, yeah. you have taken a TOEFL to, test. To wow. Yeah. And, and how was your test? Uh, my test is great. Wow, congratulations. Thank you, Miss Kitty. Wow, that's good. How long is your test long last? My test uh, long in the... Yeah. How long it the it takes yes or? how long does it take you to finish your TOEFL mm -hmm. test i take two hours two hours test ah uh, it yeah it took yeah. you it took you yeah. two hours two hours yes it took you two hours to finish it to do you it mean? yeah okay to finish it. Yes. Mm. Or you could also say it takes about, you could say so, it takes about two hours. It takes about two hours. Or it took me two hours to finish it. Yes, wow. it takes me two hours to finish it. Wow. I guess it's crazy. <laughs> yes, I hate it's examination. So but sometimes we have to do this because it's how we exercise our grammarian parts and also fluency though yeah i'm not a big fan of answering those questions oh <laughs> yes maybe you are i'm look like haura okay well uh, we are going to wait for three minutes and then we will start our lesson is it okay for you no problem no problem. Okay, so let me share to you what I've got from here. And basically, I have taught kids lately. So here it is. I have a lot of materials that you could see. But right now, I have made a practice for you. And I would like to share this. How can I sound American? This is a very common question. How do you sound like an American, but not being a native speaker, because we will never be a na as native speaker, but we can sound more natural and also fix our voice as well as your vocal power, your vocal cords could accelerate your potential to speak even more clearer, even more natural, speak with clarity and confidence and credibility. That is what we want. Yes. Not only in the lesson, I mean it that you own this kind of skill because once you own this power, you don't have any, uh, any feeling of being fear to speak English. Not only being fear, but of course, it's pretty intimidating when you hear other Americans would speak to you. Hey, how are you doing? And then your stress and anxiety will level up. Because, oh my God, I'm afraid I cannot understand what he's talking about. He's not talking like super, super, super clear to me. 
Do you feel that, Haura, sometimes? And Alpha? Do you feel yes. the pressure when someone yes. asks you? Or do I need to I invite to feel... an American? <laughs> I often feel it. You, you felt it. Yes. yes. But that's okay because I'm going to teach you how not to fear and also to overcome all of the obstacles that you've got in, what you, in whatever you are uh, thinking. Yes, because that thoughts of fear is only a thinking. It's, it's not going to come out if you are not thinking it. So I'm going to help you overcome those things, right? Hi, good evening, Ishan. How are you? Hi. Oh, hi, Miss. Oh, I'm fine. Thank you. And you? Yes, I felt really an extraordinary because I've got a good present with my friends. Yeah. <laughs> Last Christmas, as you know, we celebrate Christmas. And you, did you celebrate your Christmas? Last uh, 24th, no, if? No, I'm uh, uh, um, Islam. So. Ah, okay. Yeah. Yes, that's right. Salam alaikum, is it? Uh, yes, that's true. Wow, okay. Someone taught me and I have heard that. I will say, okay, salam alaikum. I have a, a how do you call it to say, journalist student. His name is Suta Darbusa. I don't know. How do you read this? I want to show you his name. Yes, yeah, his name is, okay, let me check. Suta. I don't know how to pronounce his name, really. What is his name? How do you pronounce this, Ishan? Sutad Dharma Saputra. Is it correct? Haura, can you help me how to pronounce this name? Um, you're correct, Miss. Sutad Dharma Saputra. Ah, okay. Yes, that's very interesting. It's the same with you. Ah, okay. Yes, it sounds like Muslim for me. Yeah. This is one of my students. Yeah, he is a journalist. And uh, yeah, it's very fun because, you know, I have learned one word in Muslim. <laughs> okay. So here's the thing. What do you think the hardest sounds are in American English for a speaker of you? Yeah, language. Of your language, okay? Yes, of language. I should add for, uh, for the speaker. Let me change my context, okay? For the speaker... For the speaker of uh, their language, okay. So, what do you think? So, what do you think the hardest sounds are in American English? Let me erase this one because we don't need you don't need it. Ishan, do you have any? Yeah. Answer with it. What do you think the hardest sounds are in English? That does like Bahasa sound English and also uh, American English. Do you think like it's difficult to understand? No, nothing. Like for example, ah, I know I have an idea. Yeah, I have remembered I S H. Yes. I have heard one of you or some of you say like shh a shh. Yeah. Can you say this, Hara? Can you read? English. Yeah, perfect. How about you, Alpha? Can you read it? English. Yeah, English. Okay. How about Ishan? Can you say this again? Uh, English. Yes, perfect. Yeah, it's correct. And uh, most of the time, if you don't 
add a little rounded lips if you say English, English. Yeah, how many times have you ever heard this? Like English, English. Without rounding your mouth, you change the pronunciation. That's why you need to round your mouth. Like English, English. Okay? Yes. Okay. So that's a very important thing in our pronunciation to round your your mouth and then you could pronounce even better. So here's the other IPA symbol, the most common misspelling. And if you have any question into a pronunciation, I can teach you with that. So this sounds is p without any vibration. If you put your right hand on your throat, you just say p like pop. You can say so, pop. Yeah. You can repeat pop. after me. Yes. Thank you. And this sounds has only like an air. Yes. You can repeat after me also. Fit. If. 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 Okay, perfect. And it sounds t. Remember that if the letter t at the first of the word, you are going to pronounce t. But in American English, usually they drop the t sound and they change like t. Yeah, t. Uh. They dropped it. I don't know why, but yeah, I will give you an example of that. Though we need to speak with clarity. That's why we are not going to do that. As you can see, native speakers cannot really speak very clearly if they don't really pronounce it well, their language. <laughs> yes, I'll give an example a little later. Um, okay, so I guess I have it here. Okay, so that is one of my favorite one. Okay, for example, yeah. Can you read this, uh, Ishan? Can you read it? Okay. In uh, an American English, American English. Yes, go ahead, please. Okay, okay. Uh, hey, how the inter interview go? Oh, I blew it. I wouldn't have even heard me. Yes, this is a very uh, clear when we are reading it. We pronounce each word, isn't it? So I'm going to give you an expression which is it sounds more American like hey held and this change the into e so how do you drop the t interview hey how would the interview go and then you goes up Urgh. blew it so we don't i mean they don't pronounce so much of i they, they don't say like i blew it I blew it, I blew it, like, oh, blew. If you see the difference, it sounds like that. Hey, how did the interview go? Urgh, I blew it. I wouldn't, and then they drop, they drop also the H. Yeah, and it sounds like, uh, wouldn't, I wouldn't, uh, I wouldn't have, like that, I wouldn't have even hard me. I wouldn't have even hired me. One more time. Hey, how did the interview go? Er, I blew it. I wouldn't have even hired me. Yes. And also the D, it sounds only, I mean, the D sound is a little subtle because they don't pronounce it well. So had me like that. So which one do you like? Do you like your own natural speaking or American English? Alpha, <laughs> because it's like American like, English. American English, okay. Yes. So no, it sounds cool. Ah, it sounds cool. <laughs> yeah. Oh my God, this is so good. It's like in a movie in a Hollywood, right? <laughs> when we are speaking. Yes, it sounds so cool. Oh, it's, it's very so cool. cool. <laughs> yes. So if you do that, yes, you can play out to your words. But for me, I like my own sound because I sound more clear 
I, I speak a lot of people and I need to be clear. <laughs> yes. So I just want to tell you the concept. How do they speak and why you are saying that they or they speak really fast. But in fact, they have a different, so different parts, right? Parts on sound that we need to understand. And that's why I would like to explain you that. Okay, so, okay, all right. Do you have any question? You can ask me also. If this lesson is very friendly. I want to ask you something. Yes, Alpha. How do you know to use the American accent like this? Oh, yes. This, it is because I... I taught and I'm also teaching English for American English and British English to my students. So I understand that by looking and understanding about this video. Would you like to see? It's very interesting. So I studied how and why. So by just watching, oh, excuse me. Can you hear? Can you hear? I can hear it. No. I uh, know you it's, can't hear it. It's not so no, clear for you. I can't hear it. Yes, it's okay. not clear. So your question, Alpha, I just want to answer it. Yes, I have known this part because when we are analyzing, if you would, we try to go a little deeper into movies, I found out that most of my students say, I can't really read and understand the movie that I'm watching. So I found out and check everything, go different it. Okay, so let me check why. Why did they don't really understand? It is those things I have taught you. Hello, Ms. Cassie. Hello, Sorry good evening. Yes, Jose, no problem. I have a problem with my computer. Yes. Sorry for that. No problem. I have recorded our lesson so that you could play about a little later because we are explaining how to sound more like an American accent or like an American. So Alpha asked me, how did you learn that thing? I told her that I have learned this concept because I have noticed those Americans when I play some music and even episodes from friends yeah every christmas episode from friends they really do and drop some words and also be, be, by the help of the phonetics yeah i understand fully how it works okay do you have any question alpha you can ask me i'm sorry miss kitty Could you yes do you have another question? No. No. No? Okay. For... I hope I answered you correctly. Yes. Are you satisfied? And also, it is because of this part. I will share with you. Excuse me. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Once you studied about phonetics, some of the diphthongs and uh, the sounds, the IPA symbol, you will never get wrong in your sound. You don't need your teacher to do that for you. And you can also take a look in your dictionaries, aren't you? But the problem is we have British and American English. Which one would you follow? So before we decide to learn English, we also know what kind of English would you like to learn? Do you want an American accent or British accent? Because if from the first place, you didn't reside and you started British and then American, it's mixed up. And you cannot really follow those two because what is the tendency is like, we have millions of vocabularies. And even me, I don't know a lot of vocabularies. Like, I mean, from British and American English. I also don't know. That's why you need to decide what kind of expression should you use in an American accent or British accent? Yeah, is it clear? Yeah. Yes, okay. And uh, we were proceeding into this part. 
Yeah. We were now here Z, with vibration. Okay. Z. As in, we say as, yeah, can you pronounce this? Holvin? Z, as in zip. You can put your right hand to your throat. Zip. Z, zip. Yes. Zip. Zip. Very good. How about this one? Z, is, z, z. Yes, it's correct. Correct. Z. Yes. Was. Bus. Was. So was has its own swa sound. And that swa sound, yeah. Uh, I'm not sure if this is the correct symbol. Yeah, like that. Swa sound is a very common pronunciation and a symbol which they are forming a circle from their throat as an American accent. Yeah. Yeah. So they say like, uh, uh. that is a swa sound. Uh, uh. Was, was. Was. If you say was. was it's what? not gonna happen. What? You cannot get was, yeah, what? was correct. Was buzz, was okay. Yeah, you can wow. also <laughs> uh, pronounce it while I am what? doing that. You can pronounce it even though you are, you were muted. It's okay. All right. So okay, let's go to sh sound. Sh like sh yeah. <laughs> Shoo, thank you, Alpha. How about another one? Shh, Holvin, yeah? Uh, sh mm, sh uh, sh wish. wish. Wish, yeah. So this is one of the examples from Holvin, right? If you cannot pronounce like English, it has to be rounded lips. If it's not, you sound like wish, 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 like this. Is it wish. clear? Yeah, this, this one, Holvin, we will have a rounded lips like wish, 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 wish. wish. Yes, oh, because God. if your mouth is quite like uh, flat or smiling, it doesn't pronounce correct, correctly. Okay. So English, the same thing of English. 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 Yes, perfect. English. Thank you, Holvin. We also say nation, nation, special, special. Yes, you're so special to me. Special. You're so special. Special. Yes. Okay, and then I, thank you. Yes, K. K. Can you read this? Cut. 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 Uh, this one cut. is different. If you say cut, cut, cut are you gonna cut something? Cut. Hey. Yeah. So if you say cut, you're cutting something, right? Is it clear? And when we say a c a t, it sounds long, right? Can't. You need to smile to to pronounce it correctly. Like can't, can't. You cannot can't. really pronounce this if you are not smiling. Can't. I tell you. Can't. This 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 word. Uh, yes. Use yes. Um, smiling uh, face. Can't. Cat, uh, it's a, a sound and a cat. Yes, it sounds like that, especially three letters. When we are pronouncing a, it has to be like, like that. Smile, smile, yes. everyone. Map, yeah. map, and cat. Cat. Yeah. Okay. Can you say it again, Haura? Alpha, Ishan, can you unmute it? I want to hear your voice if it's correct. Cap. 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 Yes, Cap. perfect. Yeah, Americans usually, usually want to hear if you pronounce it correctly. <laughs> yeah, because if you say cut, oh, what? You say, yeah. oh? <laughs> cut? Yes, cat. Map. I mean, they exaggerated things like that. Maybe I didn't pronounce it correctly for yeah. you, but you guys know that how I smile, it's also the same thing to your pronunciation. Okay. Thank you, Holden, for sharing. I would like to Thank ask you. Ishan to the second part of your sound. Yeah. I'll teach Ishan, please. Try to turn on, yeah, turn on, unmute your 
yeah, microphone. And it sounds like okay. b. 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 Can you read this one? B. Bib. Bib. Yeah, bib. 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 Yeah. Bib. Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Uh, this one has a vibration, more vibrated sound like. Can you sound it? Very perfect. And love. Love. Yes. Love. Okay. Make sure to have a vi vibration to your throat because if it's not, you sound like lab, which is b lab, or berry, very. Very. Yes. Very. Okay. And love. Next, d. Did. Did. Okay. N. Did. Point your tongue into the roof of your teeth like that. Okay. Mm. Mm. Now, oh, you guys could also yeah. copy that. You can say so. Okay. Okay. Noun. 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 And this one is zh. <laughs> like usual. Zh. Usual. Usual. Perfect. Usual. Okay. And it sounds decision. Decision. Yes, decision. decision. Perfect. Decision. Okay. And we also have this sound, uh, g. G. Good. Yes, good. Good. Yes, more good. power to your vocal cord. Good. Oh, okay. that's very good. Good. Yes. And, and big. big, big, big. Okay, yeah. thank you, Isha. You pronounced correctly. Okay. Congratulations. I would like also uh, to ask Alpha to the next part of pronunciation. Pronunciation. Okay, so here's for you, Alpha. Yeah. How does it sound? Do you remember? Hmm. <laughs> Like mom. Yes, that's right. Mom. Mom, you drop your jaw like mom. <laughs> and this one, this symbol has its like sound. Like think. Think. Okay, correct. Boss. Another word. Boss. 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 More boss. Sound. Boss. Yes, correct. Boss. Boss. Very good. Perfect. Uh, uh, uh. Make a little wider tongue position and backward to have a sound. Uh, 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 uh. Like water. Yeah. So we will use water. American English. Water. Yes. Water. Water. Okay. Water. Yes. Water. Very good. Perfect. Butter. Butter. Okay, perfect. Okay, good job. After 10 minutes, the lesson will, <laughs> will cut, I guess. Okay, so be mindful. Next is... Oh. Oh, no. Okay, good. Ooh. Just tip your tongue on the roof. Oh. Okay. Like, low. Ugh. Little, can you little, say little. this? Can you read little. it? Little. Okay, very good. Little. In American English, they say little. <laughs> because little. they are so lazy to speak, right? Uh -uh. Yes. So they say little. little. I have a little. I have a little. Little. Do you really want to sound like an American? You guys. <laughs> like little. So it sounds uh, like this. Little. Little, 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 little. Yeah, little, little. Little, little is perfect. Yeah, for little, 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 little. What, sorry, teacher. teacher. Uh, yes. Uh, when ask me, uh, uh, for example, when ask me a question, uh, tell me a little, little, little bit about, little uh, bit about uh, uh, over my, over, uh, myself for example is correct or 
the question? I'll tell a little about myself like that. Yeah. Uh, yes. Uh, when, yes. For example, it's, uh, other person say me. Uh, Ask me a like question, that. Question. A question. Okay. Uh, tell me a little, little bit about over, over you your life. You don't need to say a little, little about. Tell me a, a little only. One little. One tell little. me a little about yourself. Yes. I, I uh, sometimes uh, uh, I spend uh, a question of, of me uh, a little, 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 little bit about. Little, 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 little. Ah, about. okay. It's like a, oh, a little like part, jargon, uh, I, I guess. A small part, a small part of the life. Yeah. Oh, okay. But we don't say a little, little. Like, a little, little, uh, little bit about. He is my grandpa, grandpa. You can't say like, He's a great, great grand, grandpa, for example. Or we don't say twice, yeah, or repeat it twice. Only once, yes. Or uh, else for, you have another expressions of that. For example, uh, uh, sometime uh, uh, question. Tell me a little bit, little, 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 little bit about over your life, over your what job, uh, over your family. A, a small part of the of the life. Uh, it's, it's true. They use this part, this word. It's, it's, it's true. My question. My ah, question. okay. For that casual conversation, for me, it's okay, and everybody could also say that, especially yeah. when you were tense, when you are, you know. Sometimes we can call it as. Uh, up speak you would like to you're very excited uh, to tell you or to ask you something so that's why the tendency they repeated twice yeah for that casual conversation it's okay could you tell me a little about yourself or could you tell me a little about yourself but in the context when you are going to write that of course you don't have to say it twice yes yes because in, the, in this this question and the first time uh, when uh, I uh, I me a question this que I me a I have experience this way, I have heard mm -hmm. uh, I I I spent I a little confused <laughs> in this <laughs> uh, I I'm, I I I I'm, I am a little, uh, little nervous oh. confused nervous it's a little nervous and a little complicated in this yes. this, uh, this this uh, question. Yes. Moment. Okay. I but, see. But but constantly, it's no problem. I understand. If frequently use this 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 way. Uh, ah, okay. In this moment, I I tried. Uh, I I understand better, mm -hmm. and I I can use this word. Oh yes. Okay. Thank you, Halvin. Yeah. Thank Hi. You, good evening. Yes. Thank you, Helvin. Good evening to you, Iwan. We are studying about American English, and uh, you can play back later this practice. Yeah, it's very interesting, and uh, there are just very few teacher who teaches these things. You, you must be very lucky because in this area, uh, you just going to play into a dictionary if you would like to hear and how it sounds about this IPA symbols like that. So, okay, next one, thank you. And Alpha, we are now here in a little How do you pronounce this? Yes. Yes. Yeah. A little ju, yeah, <laughs> little ju, yes. like yes, 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 yeah. But yes. it sounds like like uh, nasally. Yes, <laughs> yes, yes. yes. A yes. Little only, not yes. It's yes, right? It's quite different. Yes, yes and yes. 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 Okay. What? What is the difference? Next it's one. A a little only of yes, with a quiet vibration. That's a difference. Yeah. Yes. Next is this one, Alpha. Choose. Yeah, it's quite choose. long. Yeah, choose. Choose. Mm -hmm. Choose. Next. Yes. Each. Each. 
Okay, each future. Okay, future. Yeah. Most future. of the time, Spanish and Latin Americans, yeah, they use say futur or uh, Italian, they say <laughs> futur. Uh, no, futur. Yes, right? Future. But it's future. We change T and U into okay. chu. Future. All the time, future. most of the time, future, churor, and what else? <laughs> Adventure, yeah, everything true, right? And culture, yes, culture. those has its own true, true. Okay. Yes, that's right. Oh my God, you pronounce it very well. You can be an American right now. Sound American. Next. Mm -hmm. Yeah, ng, ng, like sing. Ng, sing. Ng. Yes. Okay. Sing. Thank you. Perfect. Good job, Alpha. Thank you. Thank you so much for pronouncing it very well. Thank, thank you, will, Ms. Kitty. Thank you. I will ask also, uh, let's give it to Iwan. Yeah. I'll teach you how to pronounce also this uh, sound, IPA symbol. Are you ready? Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. Let's mute everybody. Which which one? Uh, yes. Whoa, whoa. Yeah, and this sound is whoa, whoa. Four, four, like, four, wow. Four. Wow. 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 Yes. Wow. Okay. Wow. Good. Same four, sound as. Four. What can you say? This. Cow. 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 How about wow. this? What is the difference? Snow. <laughs> this one is not snow. Okay. It no, sounds like uh, snow. Oh, snow. Snow. This sound is O and it's snow. Cow. 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 Yeah. Cow. Okay. Yes. Perfect. So wow. A lot of times I'll teach you where is it. For example, this is the symbol of uh, ow. You see this ow. one? Ow and Wow. Yeah. Wow. Yes. Uh, mostly this part is consonants. And this part is uh, vowel sounds. Okay. Oh, you guys, wow. Wow. Uh, I believe that you know all of this. Consonant and vowel sounds. All right. Next one is with vibration. So we have to say Z. that. That, that okay perfect e1 next one bread one bread. more time it sounds a little vi bread. vibrated like breath 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 i saw it breath. has to be with vibration breath 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 yeah. Bread. 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 Yes. Next one sounds as in say. Say. 